Life was intolerable. It was living for the moment. You know, I didn't care what the repercussions of my actions were at all. I just wanted to basically not feel, just to medicate myself. I think in the back of my head, I knew that I was eventually going to come here. Uh, but I kept putting it off, putting it off, putting it off. And then when I ended up in the hospital with a blood infection from the intravenous drug use, that's when I realized, well, I can't keep up. I can't keep doing this. I'm going to die. And I, you know, I want my life back. I want my family back. When I came here and I saw how, how kind-hearted people were and that they weren't expecting anything from me, they just wanted to help me, that it kind of it renewed my faith in humanity. The program taught me to value community and friends, and the mutual support is what gives you the ability to go on when you can talk about it and realize that other people have the same problems as you and they're working through it too. I've had my ups and downs in life, and you know I've lived I've lived good and I've lived bad, and I, I know what it's like. But I basically realize now that what's important is friends, family, and God.